uh, from the car burglaries that, uh, around Christmas when we uh, had 16 to 17 burglaries there around the east end of the county. Uh, had several firearms taken in those car burglaries. Uh, we suspected that they threw them in Shoal Creek. Uh, a fisherman the other day was down here and noticed one laying on the bottom. Uh, contacted the city of Lawrenceburg. Uh, the police department came down here. He was able to actually use his fishing uh, gear to snag the rifle and pull it out. It was laying on the bottom. The sling was floating as such. He's able to use a crankbait and pull the gun in. So once we recovered this weapon, we knew that the others are probably there. Contacted the Lawrenceburg Fire Department. Their swift water team came down yesterday. Uh, attempted to uh, to scan the bottom with metal detectors. Due to the depth of the water, the recent rain, we didn't have much luck. The uh, utility system agreed to come down today. They're going to open the dam and actually drain Shell Creek uh, to a minimum level to where we can see the bottom. And the fire department's going to attempt to retrieve the rest of the weapons if we can find them. Right now we've uh, opened up an overflow valve um, on the dam to try to drop the water level down so they can get in there. It's not going to be so high, maybe clear off the top, some of the debris and whatnot that's not going over the dam. Um, anything that they ask us to do that we can help them in, we'd love to do that. It's dropping right now around four to five inches an hour. Um, furthest we can drop it's going to be between 18 and 24 inches until we get it down below the dam level. And uh, once it gets down there, we have to keep the valve open because it will fill back up a lot quicker than that. So, uh, you know, the main thing is, is we can keep it down long enough for them to get in there and, and, and keep that area safe. So. Yeah, wintertime is a whole lot worse to, to, to drop water down because you've got groundwater coming up and you've got things melting and coming back. In summertime, it's not as bad because the water that's here is usually there. So, but uh, um, wintertime is very difficult because you have a lot of water, uh, you know, winter runoff and, and things are thawing up today just a little bit. So, but yeah, it's a little difficult to drop water in wintertime. Today we're down here, they've actually, launched for Utilities, as in a previous interview, you noticed that they were draining part of the water out for us to make it easier to, to look for the items that we're looking for. Uh, we had teams down here yesterday with, in a boat with an uh, underwater camera from the Larch County uh, Swift Water Team and the Larchburg Fire Department Swift Water Team working in conjunction with equipment and tools. And we've already went over the area very well and haven't found anything yet, but this was a just to make sure situation that we hadn't missed anything. Uh, we really don't want to put any divers in the water right now because it's cold as the water is and all the, the sickness we have going around. Uh, you know, if we, if we find something, we'll put a diver in the water and we'll, we'll retrieve it, but we'll see if we can find it before we put the divers in the water.